Hey guys, welcome back. I've been here again coming at you with more marketing tips. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. So tell me why you decided to start your own business. What was your end goal? What is the big goal that you want to accomplish after, you know, making all the money that you plan to make? <laughs> so I'm gonna let you in on my why, um, my main goal. Um, there's something me and my husband are very passionate about and that's actually, um, we love the outdoors. We're very outdoorsy and we also do, um, hunting, fishing, camping, everything that has to do with the mountains, outdoors. Um, we are very, very passionate about it. So one day we decided that we wanted to um own our own outfitters ranch and do our own guided hunts and that type of thing uh so that is my fantasy goal it is gonna cost um a pretty penny to buy the property to either buy the cabin or build a cabin um everything that comes with owning an outfitters ranch is is gonna be a huge investment for us that is considered my fantasy goal or C-type goal. Um, I've been talking to you guys about A-type and B-type goals. And here is my fantasy goal. So that is what I plan to do. And I want to know what yours is. Uh, have you even set one? Think big. Dream big. Um, there's nothing you can't do. The higher you aim, the bigger the goal is the more you're gonna work for it you know the more you want it you're gonna go for it that's that's just why we do what we do right there has to be an end goal there has to be a fantasy goal and if you haven't already set one and work your way towards it whether it's baby steps or large steps however you do it get to it i believe you can do it Alrighty, so that concludes the sequence on setting the right type of goals especially for the new year um look out for more videos from yours truly and don't forget like subscribe hit the bell click the links below and i'll see you guys next time bye